Hello, and welcome back to the LP of H.R. Geiger's Worst Nightmare. Wait, what? Sorry, I meant Microprose's Return of the Phantom. Now, last time we went through an infuriating maze to discover that Christine is trapped in the Phantom's lair. I also discovered last time I have the key to release her, but I forgot. <laughs> Thought I had to go look for one. I must save Christine! So, let's use our key to free Christine. Key. Unlock. Let's unlock the skull face. Hmm. Now unlocked. Yes, I still have my, uh... Why won't it open? Hmm. Christine! wonder if you're encouraging Rose Christine, but she is too tough frightened to reply. Oh, you're a big help, Christine. So, here we are. Creepy room. Oh, look at these skulls. Last time I was pushing them. Let's see which one will help with Christine's freedom, I guess. That didn't do it. Let's push this skull. That didn't do it. Let's push this skull. happened to you? What has he done? It is all clear to me now. The angel of music was Eric, the opera ghost. He spoke to me through my dressing room mirror. Earlier today, he... he must have sour placed me in a trance. I followed him through the mirror to this place. I knew that mirror was a fake. You are right, it opens, but only he can do it. There's a secret passage from my dressing room down to the catacombs. He assured me that no one can open it but him. How did he put you in a trance? It was with music. His voice. A violin. I was convinced he was the angel of music sent by my father. He has powers of suggestion that are impossible to resist. What happened after you followed him here? He placed me on a boat, and he rode here. At first, he was unusually kind, almost vulnerable. He played some of his opera for me. He, he professed his love to me. No, and then what? He gave me this ring. He declared I was now his bride. Here, you take it. I don't want it. This ring is a small, solid gold band. It was shortly after this that I was able to unmask him. How did you unmask him? He was playing the organ. I slowly crept behind him and grabbed it. It made him furious. I thought he was going to kill me. What did he look like? He is death personified. The poor wretch creature has a face of a corpse. It... It is horrible! But he didn't hurt you. No, we became like a pathetic little child. He cried that now I would never love him. So I tricked him. How did you trick him? I told him I would love him because he was so kind to have taught me his music. It was because of him that I am singing the lead in the opera. I begged him to let me return to perform in my leading debut. I promised to return here after the performance. But apparently it didn't work. Eric must have known about you, and I were going to meet after the opera, so he abducted me from the stage. Where is the Phantom now? He said he was going to get us some food. He should be back any minute. We must make haste. If he finds you here, he will surely kill you. No time to talk, love. Let's run. You are right. Make haste. I shall follow you. And Raoul makes haste by walking. I love you so, Christine. We should probably get this sword ready, just in case. Oh, we can't while we're walking through a door. Ooh, I wonder if he has the torture chamber. That music doesn't sound good. Oh, no! Raul, it's him! You, how dare you trespass here! Oh, no! I demand that you let us go! Christine is my bride forever. She can never leave. As for you, I shall send you to your maker. Uh, sword. Oh no! I like they kept the fireball. Can I attack Phantom? I like how he just stands there while you walk towards him. Ah! Woohoo! Oh no! Raul 
is so inexplicably un un astonished. What? What happened to him? He appears to have vanished. All the better for us. Quickly, let us run. Take the score from the organ. It may be useful. Christine has a lot of spying in this game. Take musical score. The score is a thick staff of sh a thick staff. <laughs> the score is a thick stack of staff paper with the musical notes written all over the pages. At the top is a title: Don Juan Triumphant. Don Juan Triumphant. Sorry, I had to make that joke eventually. Did I take everything from the organ? Hmm. I'm sorry, you have to look at the thingy. Down much more into the dungeon of my black despair. Hmm. Is that an ore? Let's take this ore. Christine, wait for me! This is a standard ore, useful for stealing a bolt or gondola. That was like a stick, not an ore. Why does the Phantom's Lair look like H.R. Geiger? I still want to know. Like hundreds and hundreds. Of oh, the gondola is now mysteriously here. Spooky. The gondola. I'm on a boat. I'm on a boat. Everybody look at the motherfucking boat. I'm on a boat and I'm going fast and I got a magical theme pastoral afghan. A nautical theme pastoral afghan. Oh yeah, cutscene. I can just watch. What's on the front of that boat? It looks like a dragon's head. I never told you why I wanted you to meet me after the opera. I knew Eric would come for me eventually. So I thought we should run away together. Far away. Christine, there's something about me that you don't know. Shh, darling, never mind. Let's not talk now. The silence here is comforting. Hmm. Hmm. Let's follow Christine. Why does, again, why does Christine look like an African American? Is it just the colors of this game, or? Hmm. It's weird. I never, I don't know about you guys, fans, but I never imagined Eric's lair to look like H.R. Geiger designed it. Ooh, what's through here? Ah, back in box five. Oh no! Ow! Ow! No! Cheap shot! Oh. Let's open this. I bet the Phantom stole her and took her up this time. Oh, I bet it's in the upper level. Let's see. Yup. Come on. Come on, you miserable wretch. Face me with your true face. I should have my sword out. Let's go, and I don't know why that does that. You notice the cable's a bit frayed. It might not withstand too much strain. But you throw caution to the wind and proceed. Christine is in the hands of that madman! Go, Raoul! Save your love! 